Well, we're looking at a warmer weekend. The warmest day is going to be on Saturday when we have off and on clouds and sunshine and 40 degrees. Maybe a flurry or a sprinkle on Sunday with a temperature right around 36 degrees. So we cool down just a little bit before the real warm air hits next week. So we right now have the jet stream on top of us, but it's in a motion moving to the north and east, and it starts to slip uh, more to the north on Sunday afternoon, and then early next week, it's gone. It's starting to push into areas across southern Canada, and then by the middle of the week, when we can see temperatures actually approaching 50, the polar jet is gone into southern Canada. It looks like it'll stick around the southern part of Canada for the next week or so. We did have a cold day or a cold morning, I should say, zero in Milwaukee. That could be the last time we see zeros or sub-zeros for the whole uh, month of March. One in Mad Madison, one in Green Bay, three below in Wausau and Platteville. But I think that's the end of the very chilly nighttime temperatures. Hit 39, Twin Cities 40 in Fargo, 28 in Milwaukee, 56 degrees in Des Moines. So you can see the mild air is out there. We just have to get that jet to move to the north and that'll take uh, into the early part of next week. Tonight's low temperatures will be very close to what we're experiencing on Friday evening. About 26 in Milwaukee, 26 in Racine, 25 Port Washington and Sheboygan, 26 in West Bend, about 26 in Whitewater and 25 in Waukesha and Watertown. We'll have off and on clouds overnight tonight and clear skies. You see clouds starting to push in from the west. And here's a little disturbance dropping a few sprinkles and flurries across northern Minnesota. But that disturbance is drawing in the warm air overnight tonight. That front passes through. Small chance you could see a flurry as clouds roll in towards the morning hours. And then late tomorrow, here comes the next front, and that will take temperatures downward uh, into Sunday. So another low pressure system rolls in behind that first one for Sunday. And again, that could touch off just a sprinkle or a flurry during the day. Anything that falls this weekend will not amount to much at all. So for tonight, increasing clouds actually often on clouds and clear skies. Mild air, 26 degrees, with those temperatures actually rising before dawn. So tomorrow, partly to mostly cloudy skies. Hopefully we'll get some good breaks of sunshine, which will get that temperature up to 40 degrees on westerly winds at 10 to 20 miles per hour. Tomorrow night, partly cloudy, not as cold, with a low of 23 degrees. And into Sunday, partly cloudy skies, a little cooler, but still nice for this time of the year, 36 degrees. Now check out this Storm Team 4 seven day forecast. It starts out with 40 degrees on Monday with some sunshine. We'll also see partly cloudy skies into Tuesday, 47 degrees. And on Wednesdays, our best chance of seeing 50 degrees, 48 with sunshine. We stay in the 40s into the end of the week.